Who I, set this up? Man, I, I don't know. I showed Tony this move. Yes. I, 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 I promise you I didn't do it. Shh, shut up. Shut up. Nathaniel, you got one hour to get that taken down. And if you don't, I'm fucking you up. Oh, but did you know that he came to the job thinking I was sleeping with somebody because of some fake profile? What? Yes. They knew that we'd take our packages to the stairwell. And who else knew that besides us? Hmm? Yeah, who? Belinda, that's who. Okay, a team of fans. Now, in episode seven and eight, we get more information in regards to the Fatima profile on the Get Ass Now app. I think some like, or Get Some Ass Now app. And there were a couple interesting things where, number one, I don't think Nathan was the one who found it. He's too ignorant. I mean, I mean, yes, he could pull some crap like this, but I don't know. I don't think it was him. I'm thinking one of two people made the profile. I mean, I did a video on this last week, which I haven't edited it yet, so I'll post it eventually, and it'll probably be outdated, but I recorded it, so I will edit it anyway. But I'm thinking either Angela did it, especially at the end of episode eight when the profile is brought up when Fatima mentions it and Angela's like Ooh, who would do something like that that's the kind of face and tone she uses when you could tell she's clearly lying about something and Fatima thinks it's Belinda but Angela's like no 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 I'm thinking Paul did it I'm thinking Paul did it this is a shady motherfucker he really is I mean the way he you know pops up out of nowhere the way he just constantly pulls a Steve Urkel trying to get with Deja. I mean, excuse me, not Deja. Trying to hook up with Fatima, knowing she's already taken by somebody else. And just, just passive aggressive. Or maybe like, you know, um, maybe not passive aggressive, but saying things with a double meaning. Like every time, you know, he says something positive about Fatima, he like, um, you know, says something to paint Zach in a negative light in his next breath. And, I mean, the shady shit from basically saying, hey, you know, that's a new tire, but you don't have to pay me. But in a way, I was hoping, you know, that can kind of put you in debt with me so, you know, you can go out to dinner with me. And it's like, wait, what? She has a whole fiancé, bro. But the thing is, whoever set up this profile knows Fatima's schedule, such as, you know, her going up a back stairwell in order to turn in her reports. Angela would obviously know this because she does the same thing. But remember, Paul has been working at the law firm office or that building specifically to build new offices for maybe a few weeks now. And for whatever reason, he's like, oh, yeah, we're done next week, even though or this is our last week working here, even though when he was first introduced, it was kind of like this might take a couple more weeks. But I don't know. Maybe they picked up the pace beats me. But remember it's like zach said you all don't park where the employees do so you just so happen to be walking past where my girl parks her car and you notice the tire being flat and he knew who fatima and angela were you know from their names because you know building new offices he probably saw like the names and everything but i th i think paul probably did it i think paul did look i get it angela some things really kind of point at her but if this was an episode of scooby-doo i'm thinking paul is the one whose face is under that mask so um that's what i'm thinking here i'm thinking paul was the one to set up that profile and during the whole situation in the parking garage in these episodes where zach nate tony angela and fatima had that thing going on i think paul was somewhere like he was lurking i think paul was lurking i don't care what you say my money's on Paul being the one that set up that profile. Things are just lining up, you know, oh, here's a specific doctor that I want to refer uh, Zach to. And, oh, I just happen to be at the office at the same time you are, Fatima. Oh, let me stop by the office where you've been over and you got that ass just sitting there for me to admire. And I'll hand you this warranty. I think Paul was the one that got this going. You could also, I mean, maybe him, maybe Angela's involved too. Remember the whole thing? Keep your options open, Fatima. Hey, I'm thinking it was Paul. I would say Angela would be my second guess. And then my third option would be the two of them working together on it. I don't think Belinda has anything to do with this. That's just me. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Like and subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one.